when your data logging projects need lots of storage, SD and micro SD cards are a cheap option, but they have one flaw, especially on prototyping stage. They just can't be fitted into the breadboard without any adapter, not the SD card nor the micro SD card. There's always option to order a adapter, but you can also use micro SD to SD card adapter. You might ask, isn't it just like using SD card? But no, I will show how it can be used to connect memory card to the breadboard without ruining the memory card itself. And here is how. You need to use micro SD card, which goes into the micro SD to SD card adapter, which makes the contacts a little bit larger. Then you use seven pin pin header, which will be soldered into the connects of the adapter. You will solder it into the seven middle pads, ignoring the first and the last pins. The pitch isn't the same on the adapter and the pin header, but that's okay. They will line up just fine. Here I have one finished product I made a long time ago, and I have a breadboard where I have 3.3 volt microcontroller. If you are using 5 volt microcontroller, you need to have a voltage divider or other level converter made out of, for example, two resistors per signal. Now that I connect the USB cable and run the example project from the SD library, the SD card can be read perfectly. There you go. Simple way to connect micro SD card into the breadboard without ruining the card or buying a adapter. Remember to use a level converter when using 5 volt microcontroller. Also remember to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already.